race is on for the leadership of the Ontario PC Party, and tonight Doug Ford kicked off his campaign in classic Ford fashion. I'm Natish Bassano coming to you from the Toronto Congress Centre, where a rally was held, lots of digs, lots of promises on how Ford will lead the party and the province. Doug Ford wasted no time going after Premier Kathleen Wynne and even Prime Minister Justin Trudeau as he officially introduced himself to Ford Nation as a candidate for the leadership of the Ontario PC Party in front of hundreds of supporters Saturday night. The people of Ontario have suffered under the Kathleen Wynne Liberal government Ford, who was initially running as a Toronto mayoral candidate, made the switch when the Conservative Party parted ways with former leader Patrick Brown amid allegations of sexual misconduct. But the Ford camp say the allegations won't stand in the party's way at the polls. The polling has remained strong, so it's been obviously a very difficult time for the party and a turbulent time that we weren't expecting, but it's amazing to me to see the voters are so hungry for change. Now he has two weeks to collect party votes, and he plans to get them with big promises. 100% no carbon tax, done. That's just a bad tax, it's bad for business, it's bad for people in, in this province. And uh, I, I can tell you, with the billions and billions of dollars we've seen wasted in this province, no matter if it's $8 billion on e-health or other billions of dollars, billion dollar scandals, we're, we're going to uh, make sure we put money in the back of the taxpayer's pocket instead of the government. Promises one expert says will resonate well not just with Torontonians but also Ontarians. Uh, clearly Ford is a very polarizing figure. Now the uh, paradoxical thing about Ford is he's a Toronto person but I think he could do very well in among rural members of the Conservative Party. The path to a And while he still has a lot of campaigning to do, the people who came to see him tonight say they've already been won over. Because he's a man with the region. When it comes down to saving the taxpayers' dollars, who else are you going to get besides Team Ford, you know? plans to have several rallies just like this one and hopes to meet with residents from all across the province. In the city's West End, I'm Natish Persono, City News.